out other people for what they want to do. Ma'am, she claimed to be a Christian, and I could see her you breasts. Don't even they were know. hanging out. You don't even She's know not, these people. You'll know a tree by its fruit, You were literally it, putting a bad if name a, on If Christians. a woman sitting in front of me, and I can see everything but the nipples, she's immodest, okay? You were literally putting a bad name. Yeah, 1 Corinthians chapter 6, verse 2, Christians will judge the world. Did you just say you were a Christian? I can't throw you in hell. I can judge, yes. No, you you want to give me a Bible verse that says I can? Can you want to give me a Bible verse that says I can? Only judge. First Corinthians only chapter judge. six, Tell verse two. You're that, making uh, you can't, cry. Hey, you can't touch me. Keep you're your hands to yourself. Are you kidding me? Keep your hands to yourself, ma'am. Keep your hands to yourself. How are you a prophet? You're nothing. Okay, you also have been drinking judge. alcohol. Please get out of my face. You're an idiot. You don't know God, man. Jesus. Jesus said in John 7, 24, hey. judge with righteous judgment. Hey, let me ask you this question. Are you bringing one person here to Christ tonight by judging them? And Are you going to this wicked concert? No. Yeah, bye. Don't idiot. preach to me, man. Sir, God doesn't judge. God does judge. He has a judgment day. He does. Matthew chapter 13, verse 41. We'll make our peace, but you being here is making it worse. Well, what happened to Jesus? Jesus said in John 7, 7, the world hates people. me because I testify of it that its works are evil. Jesus said in John 15, if the world hates you, they hated me first. They're going to hate me because they hate Jesus. I don't know what you But some bad. people might be saved. That's I, why we're preaching. I mean, I, I, I love your beliefs and I love it, but I don't know what you did so bad in life that you have to try to do this to make it Well, better. I want people to not go to hell. That's what I want. Well, I want people to be saved. See, notice all I got to do is preach Bible verses and people get really mad and start putting their hands on me. You're well, you're not right with God cussing like that. No, you, you don't have peace with God. There's no peace for the wicked. No, you don't know God if you're cussing. The Bible makes it clear that out of the mouth, the heart speaks. A good man brings forth good things. An evil man brings forth evil things. And I say to you, this is Jesus' words. He says, and I say to you that for every idle word men may speak, they will give an account of it in the day of judgment. For by your words you will be justified, and by your words you'll be damned. So your words will damn you. That doesn't mean it's Christian. They're not glorifying God. They're glorifying sin, man. Come on. But it's still wicked. Well, I, I would preach there, too. <laughs> I preach all over, man. No, I'm going to preach here. People need to hear the word of God. Jesus said to go into all the world, preach the gospel to every creature. That's what we're doing. But Jesus doesn't want you to be condemned. He wants you to be saved. He wants to justify you. He wants to cleanse you. He wants to save you. But there's something you must do on your part. You must repent of your sin. You must turn away from your sin and turn in a childlike faith to Jesus Christ. Childlike. You must humble yourself, and that's the problem. Many people don't want to humble themselves. They want to be prideful. They want to keep their sin, but you can't keep your law breaking and be okay with God.